Good morning, Sparrow students. I hope you had a lovely May Day weekend with um, some spring celebrations. I saw some of you had a maypole in your backyard and you had flower crowns and um, you had a beautiful celebration. Um, I'm so sad that we couldn't have our spring fest like we do every year. You know, that's one of my favorite celebrations that we have at school. Um, and it was my birthday Saturday and you guys put together a beautiful birthday video, which was really touching. It made me cry because I miss you all so much. Um, Gabriel even made me a sign, which was really cute. So thank you all for that. And thank you, Eileen and your family for singing me Mañanitas. That was really sweet. Even little man. <laughs> Um, so this week is our last week of medieval history. Uh, everything is due Friday. Uh, if you have to turn it in Saturday morning, I will forgive you, but, um, do not turn it in any later than that. And, um, I'm not, I am personally not giving you a new assignment this week because I want you guys to do a good job on your papers. Um, thank you for turning your rough drafts in so I could check those out. So far, so good. Um, this week... Because it's our last week, uh, we still have our weekly reading log. We still have some Canterbury Tales questions. And um, you still have your other assignments from your other teachers. So please make sure that you're keeping on top of everything and turning things in on time. Um, some of you have fallen a little bit behind on your assignments. So um, d do a double check in the grades in the classroom and see where you're at and see what you need to resubmit or um, what you haven't turned in yet. Okay. And uh, thank you so much again for um, your hard work and keeping on top of everything. Um, thank you for not giving your parents any grief. Um, and uh, for, for, as I said, for working so hard. So good job. Uh, one more thing. So because um, this is our uh, last week of medieval history, um, and we're moving on to a new block next week. I just want to remind you that um, after this week is up, we're starting our new block, which is business math. And you're going to have a lesson from me uh, twice a week, Monday and Wednesday. And it will be recorded, but you'll also be able to attend as a Zoom meeting. So um, make sure you put that in your calendar. Not this week. It's starting the following week when we're done with everything from medieval history. Okay? And I will remind you. I'll send you a reminder about it. Um, it was nice to have a class meeting with you all on Friday. We had a special guest with Max show up. We also had some new animals, new fur babies, some uh, cute golden doodle, um, copper, and a little baby rat, a little baby kitty. So that was really cute to see. And uh, it was nice to see your faces again, too. Uh, so look for some a little bit of history for me. You're going to hear a little bit about the samurai, um, the Bushido Code, which is very similar to a knight's code of chivalry. Uh, you're also going to, if, if you're done with everything and you want something extra to do, uh, you'll be writing a haiku for your mother for Mother's Day. I've included in the classroom stream a little um, ideas for cards that you can make. Uh, there's also a recipe for some French toast, and if you want to make chocolate-covered strawberries even, would be really nice for your mother or your female caretaker uh, who acts like a mother to you. Uh, please make sure that you do honor your mother on Mother's Day because she deserves it. And I wanted to put it out there, too, that Miss Joni, our counselor, has offered her services uh, to all of our families, even if your child is not part of the SPED program, the special ed program. Uh, if you do need um, grief counseling or if you're suffering from anxiety or depression, uh, right now she's offering those services. So if you um, would like to reach out to her and you need her email address, please text me or email me and I'll make sure to communicate that with you. She's also going to send a message out on Parent Square, so look for that. If you need anything from me at all, um, if you have questions, if you need support, uh, please don't hesitate to text me or email me. Um, text me if you can first actually because I'm getting so many messages from all the other classrooms including my own daughter's classroom that it's like sometimes the message gets buried in the stream there's 
I literally like 30 uh, messages a day. So text me, please, if you can, instead of email me. Um, and if you do email me, that's fine. I'll, I'll, I'll try to respond to you as soon as I see it. All right. Well, blessings on our week, our last week of medieval history. Keep up the good work. You guys are doing great. Just remember, one foot in front of the other gets you up the hill. All right. So good job. And um, I look forward to our class meeting on Friday. I will see you soon. I love you.